Good morning, church. Co-workers. Who is a co-worker? A person with whom one works, typically someone in a similar role or at a similar level within an organization. Are co-workers important? Oh yes, they all are. Just imagine if one person had to do all the work. Life would become burdensome, a drudgery, boring, demanding, hectic, most likely that one person would be burnt out. It would be humanly impossible to function efficiently. You may say, I would prefer that, considering the attitude of some persons. But wait a while, sometimes these persons keep us on our toes. From interacting with coworkers, we gain knowledge, improve productivity, and better understand how to deal with people individually or in a group, how to deal with conflicts, how to mitigate or resolve them. Similarly, we can appreciate people more, especially when they are pouring into our lives positively. Persons spend most of their waking hours at the workplace, and it is good to have a healthy environment where persons can share ideas, laugh heartily, be encouraged and motivated, realizing that at some workplaces, Persons find spouses, healthy, network, healthy networking can be efficient and effective. What should be the attitude of co-workers? They should be honest, humble, trustworthy, optimistic, good at problem solving, adaptable, excellent team players, possessing good organizational skills, dependable, punctual, productive, being able to see what should be done and do so without being told. What are some of the negative behaviors on the job? People are from different backgrounds and are timed with obnoxious behaviors such as, I know it all. No one can do it as well as I can. They speak down to their subordinates. The wheel cannot spin without them being there overly critical and challenges anything he is not a part of. Just enjoy making it difficult for others. Likes the blame game. Does not respect people, their input or their feelings, and the list goes on. How to alleviate or deal with such issues. Approach the troublesome coworker at a proper time in an approachable manner with the right tone of voice. Letting him know that you have his interests at heart and how his behavior affects you and the workplace. Be empathetic, but do not condone. Limit your interactions. Speak to your supervisor or manager. Maintain professionalism. With this approach, your job will be less stressful and more meaningful. The organization can be better. Your output will be better, which will make customers happy. Most of all, pray about everything and ask others in faith to support you in prayer. Be the best co-worker you possibly can.